Let's solve a couple of questions on relating phasor diagrams with equations. Here we have three circuit elements A, B and C which are connected to an AC source. The voltage across each of these is given by these equations. Choose the phasor diagram that best represents the voltage at time t and we have to choose one out of these four options. As always pause the video and give this one a try first. Alright, hopefully you have given this a shot. Now over here we have three circuit elements A, B and C which are connected to an AC source and we have these three equations. And in the options we can see the phasor diagrams for each of these three circuit elements. Let's try and look at the phase of these three circuit elements and try to understand the phase difference between these circuit elements. So we can start off with any two. Let's, let's start off with V, A and V, B. So phase of A, phase of circuit element A, that is omega t minus pi by 2. And if you look at the phase of circuit element B, that is omega t. If you think about the phase difference between A and B, that will be delta A, delta A minus delta A minus delta B. And that comes out to be equal to, that comes out to be equal to pi, in fact, minus pi by 2, minus pi by 2. So this, this really means that the circuit element A is lagging behind circuit element B by pi by 2 because we have a minus over here. So it means it is lagging behind. And on the phasor diagrams, we, we see this arrow, this curved arrow, which means that the phasors are moving in an anti-clockwise direction. So if the phase difference between these two is minus pi by 2, this means that circuit element A is lagging behind circuit element B by pi by 2 which means it should be behind, it should be below, below B by pi by 2. And that we see in options C and B, in options B and C. Now if you look at the circuit element A and C, here we can see that the phase difference, the phase difference here, so for C this is omega t plus pi by 2. So, so delta A minus delta E, sorry, minus delta C, the phase difference here, this is omega t gets cancelled off and minus pi by 2, minus pi by 2, that is minus pi, that is minus pi. So this means that the phase difference between A and C is 180, that is pi. So they should be in opposite directions, which is what we see in option B. C and A are in opposite directions. So the right answer for this one, the right answer for this one is option B. Let's look at one more. Here we have an alternating current source supplies current is which is equal to i naught sine omega t to a circuit the phasor for this current is and the current through one of the circuit elements il is shown in the phasor diagram below we can see the phasor diagram over here we need to choose the equation that best describes the current il so we need to choose one equation which describes this phasor diagram of il now if we look at this diagram we see that we see these angles 45 and 45 which means that the angle between is and il between these two vectors this is really 90 degrees this is really 90 degrees and the phase for is delta s this is just this is just omega t so delta l the phase of the circuit element l this should be either omega t plus pi by 2 or omega t minus pi by 2 we don't know if it's plus or minus right now but we know it is plus or minus pi by 2 because this angle is 90 degrees so that means the option could be either a or could be either C. But we also see that the phases are rotating in an anti-clockwise manner. We see that from the arrow here. So this means that IL is really lagging behind IS. So IL, this could be omega t minus pi by 2. The phase could be omega t minus pi by 2. And now if you do delta L minus delta S, this, the phase difference comes out to be equal to, the phase difference comes out to be equal to minus pi by 2. So this means we can write IL as, we can write IL as I naught, I naught L sine omega t minus minus pi by 2 and that is option c all right you can try more questions from this exercise in the lesson and if you're watching on youtube do check out the exercise link which is added in the description